My name is Mike Long and I'm the owner of Paul & Pinups. So a few years ago I was doing some lighting tests with the fabulous Cherry Dollface and she happens to be a pinup model and said let's do some pinups Mike and I had no idea what she was on about so we did some shots and I instantly fell in love with pinup photography and everything to do with it and it fit very nicely into what I was doing with retouching and lighting at the time. And here we go, Portland pinups. I like to test ideas with models rather than members of the public, especially if they're mad or insane, which with my imagination is quite often the case. So I use models to test things out, test new lighting, test new props, and they represent my studio rather than members of the public who like to keep it probably private just for them and their husbands. I need somebody who can be the very essence of pinup. It's not necessarily about being the most beautiful girl on the planet, it's about being fun and silly and saucy, all in one big wonderful package, and somebody who can represent the studio and go and show everybody what Portland Pinups is really all about. The semi-finalists today are going to be looked at by myself and Holly, my makeup artist, and we're going to see how the girls react to the camera, how they react to me, how they pose. And we're going to choose our favourites from today and they're going to go onto Facebook and then the winner is going to be chosen by people on Facebook. The one with the most likes is going to be the winner. What would you like to know? I'm a physical therapist. I work down in Salem. I'm 26 years old. I'm um, a manager at Starbucks. Um, I'm 19. I'm currently attending beauty school right now. 29 year old, married woman. Uh, I'm an actor, singer, dancer. Okay. I am an old soul stuck in a young body. I am a dancer. I love to be outside in the sun. Well, I'm going to concerts, so I'm traveling, visiting family. I also currently work at Nationwide Insurance. I love sports, I love playing sports. Creative. Sassy, loud, adventurous, fun, fun, spontaneous, crazy, quirky, warm, energetic, kind, loving, outgoing, and weird. Lemonade, raspberry lemonade, mango lemonade, probably a lot of frozen food, apples, leeks, turkey, steaks, uh, rice milk, seltzer water. Kombucha, vodka, let's see, yogurt, gin, and lots of really bad food. Provolone, beer, cheese, a bar of dark chocolate, lettuce, onions, garlic, butter, leftover Taco Bell, definitely. <laughs> oh, chicken tortilla soup. I just stocked it. <laughs> it's kind of like a tomboy with tits. Pinup photography means catching the nostalgia of like the 50s, 40s, like people I look up to. Like that was the ideal beauty, like that's my idea of beauty. Um, Pinup is very sexy and very feminine. Um, I love like old school Marilyn Monroe, Betty Page, and even like the modern day, um, you have like Katy Perry, Christina Aguilera. Uh, it means getting dressed up, getting dolled up, and uh, kind of letting go a little bit, having fun, and just uh, allowing your interview to come out. The truth of sexy, not the skinny girls with the you know rib cages and the lack of butts, but the curvy, voluptuous, big-lipped, big-eyed, gorgeous girls of the 40s and 50s. Like not afraid at all to be sexual and to have fun with it. It's more about power than anything else. Instead of degrading. I would love to be the Portland Pinup bombshell because I I love Pinup for one. I love being I'm so social, I'm so out there. I love to like just tell like I love talking obviously and I just think it'd be really good, like a good for you, good for me. Like I mean I, I what's not fun about posing in front of a camera and getting cute pictures and then just telling everybody about it. Like every woman should be able to feel good about themselves and take pictures, feel fun, and I think we should pass that around and I'd love to represent that. You get to play dress up, you get to be sexy in anything you put on and, uh, you know, kind of surprise yourself and surprise everyone that knows you. Um, I think it would just be a great opportunity. Um, again, like something very fun, new, and just to be a part of like 
Your guys' team would be awesome. Because I think it'd be freaking fun, and uh, it's something that I've been trying real hard to be a tomboy with tits, so I want to be secure in myself, and I feel like this would be an awesome way to do it. I feel like I have that beautiful image of myself as sexy, even though I'm curvy and I have you know, hidden wrinkles here and there. I feel like I am sexy and fun and I wanna show the women of Portland that it doesn't matter how the world sees you, as you can see yourself as sexy, then you're sexy. And Portland pinups, your Portland pinups are sexy. Half full. Kelso Longview or Kelso Washington? <laughs> did, did you use an on there? No. I just asked you questions. You bitch. Hi, Michelle. Where are you from? Where, Where am I from? from? Um, a little lost, but I'm getting there. It's just very sexy. I love it. Like Switzerland. I am. <laughs> what is the word I'm looking for? Neutral. Neutral. There we go. <laughs> My makeup artist is horrendous. She suggests the most ridiculous things to me sometimes. She's late, she doesn't show up. I'll ask the question again. <laughs> Hi, I'm Cindy Lou, and uh, I am putting in a dating video and I uh, wanted to tell a story about this. Well, when I was a child, I was chasing after a ball and I accidentally ran into a parking meter and my face stayed like this. So. Uh, anyways, I can mostly drink through a straw. Kissing's a little awkward, but we'll figure it out. And uh, I hope you call me.